That's why I said two o'clock. Okay, here. Well, hello, folks. <laughs> Back again with another tutorial and Are digital we giveaway, Black Friday. Yeah. Oh, so we're live. Okay, we need to announce who the big winner is for the one with the most hold, share. Okay, hold on a second. If you're just joining us and you're on YouTube and you impatient mofos, uh, it, this is going to be a tool demonstration as well as long uh, and uh, explanation of these tools. Uh, Jock, if you hit number three, please of these tools, we're gonna to be giving away these Reaper rods right here. We're gonna get real detailed on that and and then have some demonstration. All right, go to camera two. And then actually, yeah, so we're we're gonna be we're gonna be making some dents. Right there. I might have done it too hard right there. But you you people no, I did it. You did it. We're gonna do some of these with some Reaper rods, okay? Actually, I need to get a little bit more broad, guys. But anyways, we will get to that, all right? And then, anyways, we'll get to that good stuff here, all right? And Mary, who's the big winner for of the most shares? With the, the one with the most shares? Yeah. 28 shares? Tim 20? Green! Tim Green. <laughs> okay, uh, tell the rules. Okay, the rule is, though, if you if we're going to have contests like this again, uh, the most shares, you... You just can't win the same contest twice, okay? Mm -hmm. So, Tim, congratulations. You got a pretty decent prize, man. So, uh, you got the uh, Edgy Tool Light, the tips from Anson, and a Carbon Tech blending hammer. So, yeah, these are these 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 tips are legit. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. It wants to get you see your face. It wants okay. to see my face. Okay, cover my face. There you go. <laughs> there there we you go. go. There we go. Okay, do the do the uh, hammer, right, hammer, the beautiful hammer from Carbon Tech. Ooh. Now, this is my hammer. But you guys will get a brand new nice hammer, okay? I'm not giving you my hammer. Okay? And then, and then we still got what? Two more of these, or one more of these? Next. Okay, right. there you go. There you go. Okay. Two. Beautiful. Okay. Um, stay tuned though, because we're going to be demonstrating. We're going to be giving some Reaper tabs mm -hmm. away. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. and we're going to mm -hmm. show some of these how these work. These guys pull a mountain. In fact, they pull so hard that friggin' it has its own snow system on top of the high spot. So I mean, we gotta, we gotta tap that down. And what uh, else are you giving away? Come on. And you see this light right here? Camera one. Yeah, we got it. Uh, where's the where's the dead time one? Right there. Okay. So you want to grab that? Here's this light. We're gonna be giving away <laughs> the new dead time. Stucky light. All right. This one's going to be given away too as well in this, in this series here. Okay. Um, but right now I'm going to demonstrate it. Uh, I have a, another version right here. This is the older version that you're seeing. Uh, you can see in camera three, please. Two, two, sorry. Uh, so there you go. And we're not going to do a huge, big old long kick butt demonstration. Well, maybe, I don't know. It never turns I don't out. know. It no, never turns they're, out. He, they're here to, uh, Jaw and camera two, uh, three, please. So here is the light, okay? It does come with a battery. It doesn't come with a stand, but you can see uh, how nice this uh, this light is. It's and friggin' it's, it's orange. It's six lights. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got cool, warm, cool, warm, cool, warm. Okay, so two, two, two. Um, here's the the button system, right? As you can see right there. Pretty legit, huh? Super nice. Um, this will be a special edition. You can pick your color. Cool. So that depends on what you want. You got, I'm not, I don't know how many different colors he's got, but I know that's the green. This is the orange. I think they got red, uh, blue. So you, you, the winner will get to pick their color. Uh, Kostucky will ship it to you directly with his logo and, and Den Time. Den Time logo. Okay. So that's a special we're, edition. We're, we're, we're proud. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so there you go. We will check out some of the comments. You guys are already jumping okay, jamming, what more huh? price? Okay, more prices Hold to on. give away. I want that shirt. <laughs> They're still talking about that shirt. Still talking about the shirt. shirt. shirt who, is, who said that? That was uh, Mr. Mr. Haka. Mr. Haka. Tim Green. Hey, what up, Timmy? Did, did he know? I mean, does he know? I'm sure he does. Does he know? Ray. You got the same same people. Say they see you. You loyal followers. You 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 do it. Oh, look, I didn't see this one. Hey, respect Sydney, Australia. What's going on? Australia? Uh, g'day, mate. 
Australia. Okay. <laughs> What's up, Andy? Dan Gripper is in the house. Way to represent everybody. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, uh, okay. Con there you go. Congratulations, Tim. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Vadim. Wow. Okay, we have more say, prizes hey, to give away. Hey, check out Vadim's. It's called Dents and Dreams. Uh, Vadim, when do you have that podcast, by the way, dude? Forgive me, dude. So uh, go check out him. Uh, he is actually the sponsor of these tools. We've got a couple more tools to give away from him on a different day, which is what? Tomorrow or Saturday? Monday. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh, what? Which day? Uh, Monday. Monday, okay. We uh, have, no, we have actually Saturday and Monday. Yeah, Saturday and Monday. Tomorrow, That's the Reaper tools. Tomorrow. Mm -hmm. we're, we're getting there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is sexy, Andy, isn't it, dude? <laughs> yeah. Not sexy as, as this one, but, you know. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Donald said that he wants the light. I could use some. I could use that line. <laughs> I could use Yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna, Mary's anxious. She's like, we got all these tools and we gotta give it away. It's, it's the marathon. Yeah, okay. it's a marathon. We just wanna give it away, including my husband's tools. Okay. Just okay. kidding. <laughs> just joined. Yeah, I think we did put you down there, Garrett. So, yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay, we're also giving away more more prizes, Daddy. Yeah. You're gonna have so. to create some uh game here. I'm gonna throw this in there. All right, sure. why don't yes, why don't well, you guys tell Why me don't a we contest? Go ahead, start. You guys got a contest? Anybody got ideas? Uh, maybe John Vadine. But listen, we got some Glexo glue. It's bomb.com. Okay. We've got the Glexo. We've got the Glexo uh, magic. So what this does, we'll demonstrate a little bit this too as well. If you got a really sharp, like a small hole, but you only have a, a sharp tool to get in there, at like a 90 degree, and you find it starts to poke up the metal, well, you put a little drop in this or a little dip of that and you cure it and it stays hot it gets hard and you just now you get those soft pushes it's making those making the tip rounded more basically uh, less forgiving on the uh, more forgiving shall i say on the pushes so uh glexo look you guys i think if you've been following already you know this tool right here is bomb.com i mean this is one of my favorite tips that you can use for deep creases deep center pits bring that thing up and this and i use this a lot for motorcycle tanks as well and uh so you'll get these two tips too as well showcase the other tips okay yeah go ahead get these short these tips here and then this one okay so special thanks to glexo to our uh -huh. our other sponsor there okay. what is this for uh, we we they, we know what this is right you guys know what this Bubble is gum. right yeah it's, it's a little <laughs> It's a little bit better than bubble gum. This is the Glexo right here. Bang. That's a good shot. Glexo, Glexo's watching. They need to like take a screenshot of this one right here. So, okay. Let's talk about the Reaper rods. That's what we're here for. And then we'll talk about some other tools and give you some giveaways. If you guys have some good comments, Mary will read them and post them. So mm -hmm. let's see here. What I heard what? Mike, get ready for your interview at MTE, buddy. Oh, mm, you're interviewing me? Okay, all right. Who's going to interview you? Uh, Bobby. Bobby G. Oh, okay. Mary, give away Mike's crowns, jewel hammer. He loves that thing. Yeah. Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, by the way, I mean, we're not giving one of these away, but but if you guys can, uh, you, this, this thing is bomb. Okay. You guys probably saw me post it on my Instagram. It is a great, great tool for uh, blending crowns down. So, okay. All right. Here, let's talk about this tool. Let's go. We're going to do a demonstration of this. Uh, let's talk about the one that started it all, man. We're going to talk about the yeah. OG. Go back to the history, OG Dad. OG Dent Reaper. So, what, the story with this tool, okay. Now, this has changed. Let me show you. Where's my original one? Oh, it's in the door. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Hugo from Portugal. Yay, we have people from Portugal. Brandon Schmidt from Ginger Bros here. He's in the house. What up? Uh, so this is my original one, but I actually polished it, and it did look like the other one. But look, he's done some refinements to it because I'm my, my his is sharper now. And you see this is a little bit older okay now here's the new one that you'll be getting right here this will be sent to you this original one that's why i'm keeping the packaging on and look how nice and narrow that is right there shaved strong mofo 
strong. My, uh, my brother-in-law is uh, behind the camera right now. He's from the Philippines. He's freezing his butt off, and it's literally 70 degrees in here. It's hot it's, in here. <laughs> it's not, and he's got a sweatshirt on with two, two things on, so it's funny. <laughs> this is the Reaper Angel Rods. So we've got, look at this. He refined it, too, as well. More narrow, thicker up here, right? You've got the heel. You can make contact with the heel, and you can side load, and you can push with the tip. Adjustable handle. OK, you can also if you already have the uh, Gorilla Grip system, you can just take this handle off and put it right on there. So you're, you're good. It's compatible with that. All right. Other than that, it's ready to use. So if you don't own that, don't worry. This is an adjustable and it'll flip around and it'll do what you, do what you need to do. We are giving away this set. OK, and then we're going to give this tool away. So these will be separate ones. This will be one set for somebody and this will be another tool for somebody and then we've got another set for other people okay these are look they're everybody's like well i got I already got door tools and i got this remember what i told you about a tool look for what it can do the most for you okay this is very sharp on the back end so you can use this and you can use the side and you can use the tip so that's what i'm talking about using multi-use tool when I pick up a tool, I'm looking to feel how stout it is. I'm looking at the tips and I'm looking at the contact zones. Where am I going to be able to use the tool? And obviously the handle. Now, nothing against you, Vidane, or anyone, A1. They guys, they, they at least give you something to friggin' to have. But you probably will, if you're a professional Peter Tech, you'll probably end up upgrading your handle system or already have it. And, um, changing this handle just for comfort wise and, and generally you guys have bigger hands than me and uh, that doesn't mean anything so hold your tongue but i'm telling you generally um uh, comfort being comfortable it makes a huge difference okay but this tool that's what we're talking about this is what it's made for and look at this i'm twisting it right we're not seeing no flex in it all right this is good because when you are twisting your dent are putting pressure on the dent. You don't want any flex in here. You want all the drive to go here, right there. You don't want any delay. So this tool is going to help you out to prevent that. So let's get cracking, right? I'm not going to use this tool. I'm going to keep it pretty. I'm going to use my older one. I've got an older one right here, and he did do some refinements to it. So this this version that you're getting is is better than this one because. This more one is, thicker. Yeah, this one's got more more girth to it. Okay, and that's what you want. You you, you want that. So let's 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 uh, actually let's do the OG Reaper first. Okay, let's go to camera one. Yeah, one. So I'm gonna get set up here. Hopefully, it won't get in you guys' way. Well, I'll be a flea on a hound dog. Yeah, you guys are in the fog. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to try to work around you guys, man. All right. Actually, can I move it this way? You guys won't mind, right? Yeah. It's still not, uh, my comment's not covering your uh, dents. How many dents do you have there? It's like four? Uh, we got we got a bunch. I can see dudes. one, two, three, four. Ooh, I know how to read. We got a bunch. So, this mofo tool. Now, John Vadine's going, clean up that tool, man. Uh, my tool has been around for a little while. The dean gave me this tool, and I had it put away for about six months. And I didn't even know how good this tool was. And then one day I picked it up, and then the guys, me and the guys at PDR Tool Time, were like, man, did you use that tool? And we were no. And then we tried it, and we're like, holy crap. And we were talking about it on Dent Trainer, and it was over like Rover, man. This is a great, great tool. Sorry. I think okay, I so I took out the comments now. I'll just read it. I like it because this tool pushes so clean. It's so accurate, stout. And if you're looking for a sharp tool, I would go with the Reaper rod, the OG. Okay, the OG one. Yeah. Because it's, it's really going to help out. Now, I did customize mine because they didn't have – that system out yet. So I, what I did is I put a hub on here, an ultra hub on there. All right, and then go camera one. And what this ultra hub is that 
I've got a handle on here. I can put it on just like this, and then I can I can ratchet. So Ultra does have that system if you're interested in that system too. If you're already an Ultra person, you can get the hubs and then put it on. Or um, if you get the new OG system, you're going to have the built-on system hub, and then you can just get the Gorilla Grip system. So either way. Jaime said, nice looking rod. John Vidin. Okay. Yeah. Who's okay. that? Jaime? Yeah, that's Jaime. One of our students. Okay. Marcin from Poland saying hi. What's going on, Mr. Poland? Bobby Z wants to know. He said here, I'm going to get rid of the, uh, I'm going to just read it. I'm going to get rid of the comments. You can put it, why is it blocking? Uh, I just don't want to do. I just don't want to take a chance. Well, let, let other people see because they don't, they need to see who's saying what. Okay, let's see here. Man, that sound that neat, man. I, man. Bobby Bobby Z have a question. He what's, okay. He has a question. Up? Mike, what would you use the Reaper for mostly? Um, let me move that back a little bit. I am going to use the Reaper rod for what exactly what I'm using it for right now. There's sound deadening behind here. It really shines on aluminum panels, high strength steel, uh, or maybe you're finishing. Maybe you're going to your jaw, or maybe you're going to camera, camera. I mean, <laughs> camera one. <laughs> maybe you're going to your, your fine finishing. All right. And when you're going to your fine finishing, that's where you want to use that Reaper the most. Okay. Listen, guys, here's here's the deal. You got it's like PDR is like a relay, okay? But not a race. You've got your soft tip, you got your midpoint, and you got your sharp. Generally, when you get much better, you usually either one or two tools. Or meaning if you have a soft tip version where you have, you can screw on your tips, then you 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 can go again, you can switch those tips. But when you get really good. You could probably finish it, start and finish it with a Reaper rod or a Door Lord Sharp or something like, or a PDR Finesse or something like that. Personally, I like to stay safe. I generally do too. So I'll go with a soft tip, get it right to where I want, switch it out, have a Door Lord, have a Reaper, have Finesse and finish it. And this is what this is for. So that is why I would use, I would use this tool over just a, a, no, a normal tool okay so that's that's why uh i hope that answers your question bobby why why i would use this tool okay mm -hmm. and there is some sound deadening in here now i would not want to use a soft tip and and some really bad sound deadening this has got some waffle sandpaper of sound sound deadening it feels like sandpaper but um yeah this is what i would use it for so hope that helps answer your question here yep okay let me see Rudy from Belgium. Ooh, that's the first one, Belgium. We have people from Belgium. If here. there's, if you know, I'd like to know if people on Dent Trainer, if they have any, if they give me any feedback, what would you guys like to see more on there? Like, what kind of tutorials? Oh, because I like, I like feedback. And you can. Uh, Eric Lee keep asking, calling me girl. I'm Mrs. Toledo. He said I sound like a Hawaiian girl. Hawaiian? Yeah. Hawaiian Filipino. <laughs> Bobby C said thank you. Yeah, it's this this tool is legit. If you can go to uh, uh, camera one, Ja, that would be helpful. Okay. Bobby wants to know what's happening behind the panel, Mike. I wish I could show you, honestly. Uh, <laughs> He's doing his uh, magic. Yeah, it's... This is not an easy dent. No, it's it's not. It's in the beginning he actually showed um, when he put the dent on that yeah. car. Yeah, it's. But if you're a new learner, right? Then you see these other little ones right here. Um, if you're a new learner, you you really want to depend on your reflection, right? You got to see which what which one you understand the most. Okay, is it lines? Is it fog? Personally, I think it's going to be easier if you're brand new to learn lines and then go to fog. I just think it's it's way beneficial because it's harder, I believe, to learn lines. That's, that's why I think it's 
Lines is the mean guy. Yeah, and then your fog is like the real, hey, he's the patient. That's oh, right here. You're told the lines is like, no, nah, that's the truth. Your dent looks like crap. You need to redo it. It's you can't it's lie. Hard. Yeah, it doesn't lie. I, and that's not saying that again, the reflection is better than the other. I just feel like if you want to pick a reflection, number one, first of all, what do you understand the most? And then go with that. But the other thing is go with lines and um, first if you want to learn straight from the start okay and then you can learn fog it's much easier to pick up some people might disagree with me on that um anything else any other questions on that so hello from germany okay dan dorsey said hi what's up mr dorsey and he said i fully agree so i don't know which one he's fully agreeing on maybe uh the line and the fog or something like that i don't know yeah, and it's not saying it's not saying three please um it's not saying that that either or now i'm not i'm not going to go into the same thing with these these do the same thing these are just way more forgiving you guys okay this is the this is the uh dent reaper angel rods this is the dent reaper you'll get the newest one now this one look at the look at the difference between these tips okay if i can put it down and he said lines are harder than fog yeah they are dude Trust me. Yeah. Okay. This one is the new one right here. Okay. You're going to get a much sharper pull push with this. I rather have just a, a, just a blunt and then sharp. That's just my go-to. Okay. Um, we're about Did to ready to that? give these away. I Did fixed you? it good enough. All right. Stop oh, okay. it. <laughs> There's all oh, those are two other ones. Let me, let me, my do wife's giving me crap. dude. Okay. Fine. Let, let me do the QA. Let me see if you did that job right. <laughs> <laughs> thoroughly no the guys say, they, they're, they're gonna say something to me he's like mike I could okay fixed. eric lee has a question what's up now when you work any panel you disturb the paint and rust proofing do you have a re-rep what rep rep on the rust proofing oh no, that's a good question but what here's, does that mean i know what he means he's okay. he's saying that our tools can cause scratch marks in the panel uh, to be truthfully, we, PDR has never been never been proven to hurt the panel in any way, shape, or form, um, or cause any rusting. Mm -hmm. uh, however, uh, if if it did get to that point, maybe on a, on a hood or roof, yes, we can uh, rust proof it by uh, painting the e coat back on. But in this case here, this has got sound deadening, and about eighty percent of the panels now have that sound deadening. So uh, that is really not going to matter. So. Okay, one, one more question. It said, it said over here, um, why is there so many different colors comes to the light board? Oh, a reflection? Okay. Again, that's preference. So um, if I switch, oops, let me switch it. So this is our, we call this cool, right? And this is, a, this is the warm. This is actually my preference. I like that when I'm fixing it, dents on fog uh, or hail damage. It's just a preference thing. Some guys like both. All right. And that gives them a little bit more wider fog in that type. I'm actually not looking at the, letting you look at the way I you would professionally look at it. You would look at it from the further one over here from that reflection. What? What's going on? Vinny is just commenting something funny. He's, I should I should have some alcohol here. <laughs> yeah, Vince is gonna make fun of my fog stuff, dude. So yeah, he's he's yeah, Vinny said that I should hey, uh, I should drink some alcohol. If he can fix it, uh, fix dents on lines, then he can, then he has a he can comment. Okay, so. Eric Lee <laughs> said thanks, You're Mike. Welcome. You're welcome. It is just a preference thing, guys. So that's that's all it is. So, um, and somebody even wants to know who's switching the cameras. <laughs> yeah, I know. it's magic. It's magic. <laughs> we got this robot called Jock. <laughs> All right. Um, we're using the the uh, Dent Reaper Angel Rods. Uh, I haven't used his new one. I don't want to damage the new one. I was anxious to try try it out, but uh, this one pull this one just works awesome. And I I can imagine just uh, using the newest one where you're going to have less flex. So that one has a tiny flex, and I gave him some feedback, Mr. Vadine, and. And, uh, you know, it's one thing about us PDR techs. We take feedback from other PDR techs seriously. You know what I mean? Like if we, we get 
feed, a good feedback from something, we're text. We'll listen to other texts because we want it to be the best. Go, keep going to uh, two again. Yeah, I just want to finish this out here. Okay, so Mike, you're using the angel right now. Yeah, I'm right. Using angel, yeah. Okay, and earlier you used the OG one, correct? Yep. Okay. And this one's more forgiving, uh, as far as you know. You're not going to make as much poke marks as easily. You know, I I wouldn't suggest really going to a a um a sharp tip until you're ready to finish it. Okay. Switch here. So. Yeah, this is just a little too. Go ahead, Mom. You're gonna I'm give gonna me read, some. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna read some feedbacks here. Okay. Am I in the way? Bobby Z asked, when it comes to lines, or I mean, when it comes to lines on a board, is thinner better than thicker? You know, that's a that's a good question, Bobby. Uh, I feel like if you get more experience, I think thinner lines are better because you can always bring those thinner lines in. And but you're gonna you always feel like you need thinner lines at the at the when you're getting close to the finishing. So that's a good question. Shane Roses from All Out Dent. I trained him. He uses nothing but thin lines. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's a total preference thing. But good question. I think a lot thinner lines are gonna give you more detail. So. Okay. Okay. Bicimoto. Greetings from McAllen, Texas. Can you put? Can you post that, Mary? You don't have. To, let me see what the question is, so people can see it. Please. Okay, here. But I don't want to cover your. You're, you're okay. We're okay, sure. The question. Okay, so that was already answered. Let me see here. Okay, Eric Lee, Eric Lee said this is probably something that he wants to pursue when he's retired, which is uh, in the near future. Good. Okay, Good. Marcin. Yeah, go check out dentrainer.com. Uh, Eric, and you'll you'll get a good head start to see if that really uh, what you want to do. you want to do for mm -hmm. a low low investment. Mm -hmm. so. Okay, Marcin said magic. I know it. <laughs> okay, okay, Andy. He said I bought that flat bar you were showing earlier. Super excited. Oh, about cool, getting. Andy. Yeah, you're gonna like that, man. Yeah, you're mm -hmm. gonna like that. Dude. That's mm -hmm. a that's a dope ass hail bar. Okay, so we're we gonna do some giveaways before um, we give the main giveaway. Sure. What what was the giveaway? Oh, this one. Top. Do, do you have some kind of a? Uh oh. Oh, that was one of the VIPs. Yep. Okay. Let's go. So check this out, dude. This is this is the extra large VIP right here. I'm not getting there. It is there. Look at that beautiful little piece of thing. What are we giving oh, away? Okay, hold on, hold on. Before we give away something, okay, let's just give some of this out right now. Oh, you want to do that? Yeah. Okay. Let's keep them. The original one, right? Let's give the OG. The OG one? Okay. So let me go ahead and here, you control the um, random.org. All right, here we go. Let me go to, oh, by the way, by the way, guys, um, Dent Reaper is offering 10% discount off of their uh their entire actually i shouldn't say that but 10 percent i think they do it's yeah. automatic 10 percent yep. off their website mm -hmm. so you want to go check that out uh this is their website here uh, and then you can go check out their og stuff original dent reapers mm -hmm. uh, like right here this is the original one that he gave me just like this one dude and there's mr vadine himself right here okay Mr. Vadim, you're going to love Vadim. He is one of the best guys you can meet in this industry. Always positive guy. Never has anything bad to say uh, except me here and there. But, <laughs> but other than That's that, just uh, for joke, Dad. Yes, yeah, just joke. Okay, so I'm going to stop doing that. We're going to go to random.com. Mm -hmm. All right. And we're giving away the OG Reaper Rod. Oops, OG Reaper Rod. You ready? Yeah, I'm oh. ready. I'm prepared. What's the number? You want to type it in? Mm -hmm. The new number? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm generating it. Oh, no, 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 no. Do I it again. No, 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 no. You have to let them see it. Oh. Let's see what do. Generate it. Okay, I'm, I, I haven't seen it. They haven't seen it yet. I haven't put it on. Oh, okay. So I, I thought you, you already. Wait. I Ready? thought you streamed it already. Here we go. Okay, here we go. 
210. 210. And the number is 210. Okay. 210. I might know who this is. Okay, hold on. What do you mean? Because I kind of, uh, fami I'm familiar with the email address. I'm checking who this person is. Hold on. What other tools are you guys interested in? You know, we're going to do some Reaper. Actually, you know what? We're going to do a glue poll next. Uh-huh. Okay. For VIP? I got to get set up. You got to get, we're going to go at three o'clock. We're going to do a glue pole on a rail and a blending hammer uh, demo. So I'm going to do that at three o'clock. All right. That means right after we get set, put these tools out and then we're going to have at least three more contests during that, during that to give away. And do we have any other contests we're okay. giving away right now? Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. So announce the winner. Who is it? Can you read that? No, but so, Justin oh. Schlager. Justin Schlager, Extreme Dents, right? Yeah. So Justin Schlager. So that is the, uh, he won the Reaper Rod. You got him written down? Uh-huh. The OG one. OG. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. Now we're going to go. <laughs> Everybody's like, me, 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 me. Mike, maybe you could do a movie off what happens inside the door for you to push against the window. <laughs> What? What? Okay, We're thinking of a movie. <laughs> you, we could, I could do that. I mean, that's pretty easy. Um, but the, remember, keep in mind the art of this thing is you're not going to be able to see what that tool's doing uh, unless you're trying to use it just as a, as a thought process reference. But that's easy to do. You might have saw me doing a, a, a video on YouTube called the Crane Tool from from Stanliner that I show in in a panel how it's doing it on a prepped panel. And you can see how that's working, how it's making contact against the panel. So that might be helpful, but yeah, I could I could do a door panel. It's pretty easy to do that. So uh, let's see here. Okay, so <laughs> we're gonna do the this demonstration. Make it awesome. Yeah, Andy, I thought it was too, man. You know, and the one thing about the reason why we're doing the demonstrations this year is because we're helping the tool companies. Mm -hmm. you know, showcase what their tools can do, right? Instead of like, oh, here's the tool, you know, this is work, you're supposed to do this, and then and then, it, and then you're, you win it, which is cool. It's fun. It gets to the point, but at least this looks more interactive and, and people who get a little bit more learning out of it too. Yeah, as well. we so, want to show you guys how yeah. it's used effectively. Thanks, Andy. Yeah. Okay, so, so are we going to do the angel now? Yeah, let's do the, the angel one. set. Here, you got to go back to this one. Show what's Okay. The... Yeah, I'll do that. The angel cool, Vadine. Thanks, man. I appreciate your support, man. Publicly, thank you very much for what you do, John. Um, really helpful, man. Been supportive, and he supports everybody in the industry, including us. And it doesn't go without notice, man. Thank you very much. Okay, so you got to show the okay. angel set. This is a big one because it's the okay. set. Here comes the angel set. Yeah. We're gonna go random.org. Ready? Yeah. Go back here. We're we gonna generate it right now. Here we go. Three, two, one. 63 63 Ooh, it's like a low number low number now huh okay so let me just see it 63 63 63 okay 63 hold on um what we're going to do with that demonstration too as well at two o'clock or if i know three o'clock it might be between three three or five depends on how long it takes me to get set up but we're going to give away some of these tap downs because we're going to demonstrate the tap downs we are going to give away some Reaper tabs. We're going uh -huh. to demonstrate some of those Reaper tabs, some Anson tabs. We'll probably use uh -huh. some of those, try how that works. Some glue because it's going to be glue related. And we're going to give away the trifecta gun too as well. Uh-huh. All right. Mm -hmm. And a blending hammer. So that is all coming up uh, around 3 o'clock, okay? Uh, also don't, don't quote me on between 3 and 3.15. This is the trifecta, by the way. If you guys haven't seen this, actually, let me go over here. It's going to be easier. If you haven't seen this, you never heard of this one. Let me just take a tab right here. I got a tab here. Let me show you how accurate this freaking trifecta gun is, man. Look at a small tab right here. Actually, let's get anything. Let me see. All right. It's going to focus there. Look how, look how accurate. Tiny, this trifecta nozzle is legit, just worth it on its own. Now, this is a used one. You ain't going to get the used one. You'll get a new one. This is going to be courtesy of Limident. 
who's going to offer you guys this right here. You've got a high switch right here. You've got eco mode, which is the blue. I'll put a better camera on the next time right here. And we are using the Dent Reaper purple. Perfect purple, I think they call it, right? Or something. Jim Vadim. I think I don't want to mess up the name. It is awesome. It feels great in the hands. You got the nice grip in the back, right? It does have a little thing right here, but I broke it off. But that that, that controls the, the um, tension on your trigger. But here's another tech tip, too. When you're using something like this, you don't let it warm up, okay? If it's hard to squeeze, don't keep squeezing it. Let it, let it. If I turned it off, let it, let it come out like nice and easy. Okay. And look at, look at this sucker, man. Just, just super nice. And it doesn't drip all over the place either. Okay. This is what it, how many is in here? 10? I think it's 10, right? We're giving, we're giving those away. 10. Reaper. Okay. So we're going to give one of these away. The trifecta is from, from a Mm-hmm. He's also going to include uh, base of your choice. So this one's working with a DeWalt. And I forgot what else he said. He, I got to look at his, his text. And he's going to drop ship it. So, all right. And bada bing, bada bing. Okay. We're also giving away the, um, the Stucky light Camera today. Jaw. Today. Okay. okay. And the Stucky light. Is yeah, that... today. Today? We're giving it away today. Okay, today. Yeah. All right. So who's, who's the winner of that one? Okay. The Reaper Angel Rod Set. The winner is Joseph Hamblin. Joseph, Joseph Hamblin. Hamblin. Joseph Hamblin. Okay. Cool. Spelling of the last name is H A M B L E N. Joseph Hamblin. Yep. Doc Dent. So we, we will post. Are you been posting that winners? I'm going to post have... that at the end because we're doing a marathon. So we're okay. going. We'll be posting fast. all yeah. the winners too on each of this thing too as well. But you will get contacted as well. We got your information on there what did we do any giveaways in between here uh no we're gonna give away we're gonna do this now we gotta okay. do some giveaways right here i know you guys are waiting so okay what what uh game do you wanna do you wanna do what do you guys want to do man? <laughs> somebody say duck duck goose <laughs> duck duck goose <laughs> no. duck duck goose come on <laughs> give it, give it, give it. Suggested. Oh, okay. John Vidin. Vidin, why don't you call the game, dude? Tell me what uh, what contest should they have, dude? We we did like most shares. Uh huh. We, we did that already. We did that one already. Uh, we did last comment wins. Well, we could do how, that again. How about how about how about no. we do um like because you were talking. Look at already. Tim Green. Last comment. <laughs> Tim, remember you can't win twice. Well, he, did he win that last comment? No, um, he, did. he won the first comment, yeah. didn't he? So. No. Um. When you were doing the I, I, duck, duck, gray duck, <laughs> John Vidin said duck, duck, gray duck. Okay. Nobody's, nobody, duck, duck, gray duck. <laughs> or or you, what you can do is we can actually do, um, no, we can do that later, actually. No, Last not, comment here. All right. Okay. What about the, you, you were doing something, uh, a demonstration. Anyone can remember what you were teaching them, like telling people? Create something. How about uh, Who how about this? What year? And Vadim will call the winner. What year did the original Dent Reaper come out? Would they know that? That's the point. It's not easy. <laughs> Somebody's probably texting Vadim now. If they guess, they guess. <laughs> Vadim, Vadim, Vadim. I okay. Yeah. You 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 yeah, start naming the years, guys. Let's the first one that names the year. The <laughs> dean's gonna know the answer. I don't have the answer. Okay, I'll answer to you. I kind of an idea when. It oh my was. gosh! Okay, so is Vidin still here? Oh, it's a secret. Vidin said it's a secret. No, he'll tell it. Come on, Vidin, tell him what year. Wow. Look at everybody like 1995, hey. 2019. The original one came out a while ago. That's all I can say. <laughs> 1810. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby, Bobby, 2018. John no, Vadim, you're not supposed to tell them who did it. No, the, no. Who, who's the winner? Well, the, the, okay. Well, who's the oh, closest Joe one? Lou. Joe Lou. Joe Lou. Joe Lou won. Dude. Okay, so it's 2018. Congratulations, Joe. You. You just won. Yep. 
You just won this, dude. Okay, so, okay. so do you want to do a drawing? Oh, again? so Vadim did. He, that's why he put it to 2018 because that's when it was originated. Okay. okay. Listen, guys, I got to set up, man. I got to, we'll be back around three. No, just three. do another drawing. Okay, I'm going to do another drawing. Let's do another drawing. Okay. Okay, sorry, guys, but while Mike is setting up, I'm going to do another Pack drawing. Pack of Reapers. Since we're on Reaper right now, okay? Okay, okay. Included here? No, that's already, <laughs> that's already Joe. Okay, right okay. This is, what, what, what's the uh, winner? Okay, Joe, Joe Lou. Lou. Yeah, okay. I think it's 2018. Ah, Jeff, you're a little too late, doc. So uh, let's see here. Listen to the boss. My <laughs> Shh. They said, they're like, listen to the boss. They want more contests, okay? All right, so we got a pack of Reaper tabs right here. Okay, so what's okay. the contest? Come on, something easy. Something easy. Okay, throw a couple of no, those. No, no, no. Okay. Make it last. Make it last. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give it all. Let's give it all right now. Winner take all. Dude. All right. Uh, okay. Pay pack of reapers. Wait, wait. What do you guys want to do? Like, give me some ideas. How about how many years you've been? Oh, wow, that's easy. I, I, okay, who guys. can who can guess how long Mike been doing dance? Wins a pack of reaper. Oh, all right, the first one. Well, you guys are gonna up. Okay, well, let so me give you something. Can, okay, okay. How about? Who, okay. So, no, no. Okay. No. <laughs> when, when did when did Mary and I? What year? Did we start then time? I start. Did we start then time? Okay, there you go. Yeah. I've been always saying got, on my podcast. Got right here. <laughs> I almost got killed right here. I've been saying it all the time on my podcast. What year? Not not when I started. There's a difference. What year did I start then time? I was with my stepdad for 10 years. Oh, no. Tim Green got it again. 2001. Who? Tim Green. Right you, there. You mofo. He's been watching you. <laughs> Tim right, Green, Tim. congrats. You Congratulations, dude. You got, you got a pack of Reapers, dude. Yeah. 2001. I started in 1991 with my stepdad uh, called Dent Man. And then, uh, then I... Uh, started my own company with Mary in 2001. So uh, that's how that happened. And uh, in order to be super successful, right, they say in order to become a good leader, you had to become a good follower. And uh, I did that for 10 years with my stepdad. Uh, so he, he, he showed me the ropes a lot and I suffered a lot like that. Dude. But uh, it was it was good. I, I do not regret it. So. Okay, another giveaway. MTRX $500 gift card. Okay. One more five hundred dollar gift card to, to if you already have Mobile Tech RX, you're gonna get five hundred dollars free. So okay, so credit towards your your uh, membership. So here we go. All right. Okay. What's your uh, what's your contest? Have Somebody says here. this is actually fun. The contest. Okay. So now remember, this is a five hundred dollar. Okay. So what's your contest? Make it a little harder, Mike. <laughs> Who can guess when Bobby Z started Dent Zero? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, that might be one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me let me ask you this. This is a good one right here. Who is who is one of the famous people? Actually, I wouldn't call him famous. He is famous. I don't think a lot of you guys know him. He worked for Dent Wizard. He actually started Dent Wizard in the early '80s, and that's how it really became popular. Who was the name of the person? You don't have to get the last name. Just what was the first name of that person? Do you have an idea? Say, say the question again. He started Dent Wizard. He started Dent Wizard. He's one of the founders of Dent Wizard. Bruce Kelly? No. No. Lito. Damn it, Tim. See? <laughs> it's Lito. Is it Lito, Dad? Yeah. Yeah, it is Lito. Uh, okay. So we're going, okay, we're going as we see the, the Tim, you're not where you're not making it, you're not gonna win any more contests, dude. <laughs> okay. So he just won the five hundred dollar MTRX. I thought that was gonna be a hard one, man. Oh yeah. man. So he knows his history in the Vadim, PDR industry. The Dean's like you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. So some of you a lot of you guys did know. Good a lot of you guys do know. So that's good, man. Way to go respect with that, man. So 
Okay. okay. I, we got to get off the air right now. If you guys want me to be on time back then, it, now I'm going to say, I'm going to say between 305, 315 because I start to set up. Okay. What's your next? Um, we're going to do Dent Reaper tabs. We're going to do the blending hammer. We're from going, VIP. Yep. We're going to do uh, the Kiko. The, uh, is Kiko on? Yeah, no, he's, a, no. he, he's on my agenda. No, I'm not doing that one right now because that's we're going to do rails. So, oh, okay. And then we're going to do blending hammer, Kiko, no, uh, Reaper tabs, Reaper glue, trifecta. This is all what we're giving away because it's all related to it, okay? And the – I think that's it right now. We'll, we'll think of other stuff, but there's going to be four to five uh, things to give away in the, in the next half hour, okay? Stay tuned. And uh, share this anyways. If you guys got a good heart, please help share this. Help support us. And thank you guys for your support. As always, thank you to all the tool companies. And we'll be back on, okay? I think we're going to do one to two more contests uh, after this. See ya.